we're going to learn how to do the double crochet decrease and what it is is making two stitches or more become one so we're just going to learn when two stitches become one which is just your basic decrease so for our double crochet we go into the stitch because here our chain one counts as our first stitch going into this stitch we're going to yarn over and pull up a loop we've got two on our hook so normally we would yarn over and pull through both loops to complete our stitch but we're leaving our stitches on our hook like that so we're going to yarn uh, sorry we're going to go into the next stitch because we don't yarn over with our double crochet so going into the next stitch we're going to yarn over and pull up a loop so normally you would yarn over again and pull through two but this time we need to capture this stitch here so we're going to yarn over and pull through all three so let's do a double crochet decrease on the next stitch we go into the next stitch we're going to do it over the next two stitches so yarn over pull up a loop we've got two on our hook you go into the next stitch yarn over pull up a loop we have three on a hook yarn over and pull through all three so we've just made those four stitches become two because we've decreased over two stitches so I hope you enjoyed that quick lesson and until next time, happy crochet.